Hello everybody, this is Arathas and welcome mm -hmm. to today's stream, where we are back to Conan Exiles. Uh, as far as I'm aware, the main thing that I'm planning on doing this episode, or this stream, is we're going to keep working on the shrines. That was some weird looking lightning, I gotta say. But yeah, we're going to start working on upgrading our shrines. So... Let's see what we have to get this dude. I think it's pretty much just 75 of the previous items. I think every shrine to the next level needs 75. Uh, whatever they're called. Manifestations of zeal. So I need 75 human flesh again. Dude down there is going to need 75... Well, a lot more than that. I need to make 75 hunks of ice. Thankfully I've already got him converting ice shards. Uh, he's going to need the heart. So yeah. Another thing I want to do today is I want to try to go on a bit of an adventure and get certain materials so we can give our priests the proper bodyguards. Uh, which means I want two suits of Aquilonian armor for the guards I'm going to place up there with the Mitran priest. I need two sets of Stygian armor for Set. I don't need any for Emir because they already have Nordheimer armor. I need the Darfari set for them. And Derketo is the Lemurian. So let's see what we need for all that shit, shall we? Silk. We need a lot of silk. Because the Lemurian warrior, well, it just needs leather, but also needs perfected medium chest piece, so... That'll be interesting to go with the Lemurian. I do think they just added that, actually. I think you're right, uh, Stahor. I think the weather thing was added. Now, it was raining partially, I think, in our last stream, but yeah, it just recently started. So let's see, we need to collect ivory, we need to collect fangs. But the big one does appear to be, if we want... I do believe we're going to need a lot of silk. Okay, you only make the perfected one. Okay, let me go talk to this one. Aquilonian, please. I want the armor to... Thank you. Down here. Rhino hide, I have it sitting around somewhere. Hey, Michael, how's it going? Okay, so Stygian soldier... Titan's not hard. Oh, and thick leather? I thought I needed silk. I guess I just need silk for Lemurian. Well, time to collect ivory, silk, and, um, chitin. That is all shit we can do fairly easily. Let me repair my weapon down here. Got my skin and knife. Alright, let's go get stuff. Yep, I am streaming. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to... It's going to be a little bit harder for people to know when I'm streaming, though, because according to some shit I was reading about what YouTube's been doing lately, uh, I am not going to be putting up my little video on YouTube that says now streaming on Twitch based on some of YouTube's actions recently. So, yeah... It's a good idea, Stahor. Let me see what I need for it. Let's see. Weapon upgrade kit. That's the reinforcement for the armor. Advanced weapon damage kit. I need oil. I don't know if I have any, but I can get it pretty easily. In fact, the easiest way. I need to make more food anyway. <laughs> well, you're part of the clan now, Michael, so they shouldn't murder you outright next time. <laughs> Get a bunch of this shit and just have my thralls cook it up for me. Hmm. 
And I'm just gonna go put the weak fish, or the, not the weak fish, but the unappetizing fish in the fluid press. Okay, I did that once, Michael. That was an accident. I was trying to figure out exactly how to go about adding you to a guild or clan or whatever the hell you want to call it. <laughs> Alright, we're going to throw in you, two of each type of fish, which I can't. Let's get rid of that. Take the honey. You, you, and you. Now you can make me fish strips. <laughs> I mean, yeah, you can look at it that way if you'd like. <laughs> I didn't turn the stove on. You would think the thrall would turn the stove on, you know? It's kind of annoying that it doesn't. Fluid press, you take these guys. Plenty of oil, but I'm going to go ahead and give the order to make more, because, I mean, why the hell not? Take that. Okay. Yeah, seriously, I mean, I understand them not turning on the cook fires, the fire, like, everything. I understand it not being turned on if you... Uh, how's it go? Um, like, if you don't have a dude tending it, right? It's like, that makes sense. It does not make sense when... Um, there's a dude standing right there whose job it is to do that whole damn thing. It's like, yeah, I'll cook all the fish strips for you. Okay. Why aren't you cooking the fish strips? Well, you need to turn on the fire for me first. It's like, god damn it. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's see. Throw this in here. Time for some fertilizer. You take these two. You take these two. <laughs> the problem with brainwashing. You know what? That could very well be it, Stahor. <laughs> hey, Wasteland, how's it going? I know I'm going to need more bone meal to make fertilizer. But when I have all this extra food, I like to throw it in here anyway, so I don't run into a shortage of rotten meat when I'm ready. <laughs> Alright, so we got that. Sure, uh, let me go ahead and send you the invite real quick. Just take but a moment. All right, sent. Yeah, sorry about that. By default, I have um, all of my Steam settings and everything to be like, you know, like the chat system in particular, to just show me offline, you know, when I log in. Because I, I absolutely hate systems that are like, do you want us to boot, you know, to log you in as soon as your computer starts? Do you want us to start these apps when your computer starts. It's like, hell no, I don't want you to do any of that. Just a little pet peeve I have. Alright, let's make the advanced weapon damage kit. Do I have a better one, or is that... No, that's the best one I can make. Cannot modify items that are damaged. Well, considering you won't let me repair the weapon further, I don't think I can upgrade it then. That's a shame. Uh, what? There's just an unconscious body in the middle of my damn base. Ah, uh, sure. Give me a moment. I'm assuming, <laughs> yeah, I don't know who the hell that is, but okay. 
All right, invitation sent. All right, here we go. Grab some water. And let's see, the only thing I have done since the last stream, for those of you who have been... Um, who have been following along and uh, maybe missed the beginning of the stream, is I have upgraded every one of our shrines to the first upgrade. Not, nothing beyond that. And I've been collecting ice so I can make... Well, I've been collecting ice shards so I can make ice over here for the... Uh, what do you call them? The stupid things of faith, manifestations of zeal. And I've made a few trips up to the frozen north to collect black ice. That's what this chest is for. So, we got some black ice that I'm going to use to upgrade some walls and shit. Because I've been curious. What the hell? Authentication failed. Huh. The only time I get that error, Michael, is um, if Steam has a pending update that hasn't finished. Usually it fixes it if I just restart Steam, but it's up to you if you want to try that. Okay. Where do we want to go from here? Well, we have more people we need to murder. Oh yes, I should probably see about dragging that dude to the Wheel of Pain. Uh, wasteland. Let's see. Let me go get a rope. So I don't think I have any of my lashes on me. I do not. Bindings, lashes, whatever. Are they in here? One of them is. See if that body's still laying around up there. Kind of a weird body to just be laying around, too. I mean, it's... There's, like, no name. It's just there. <laughs> it's naked. I don't... <laughs> nope, I can't do anything to it. Ah. I think, it's a, I think it's another player. I'm starting to wonder if it's Michael. Now it's a body. With 40 cooked savory fish. Ah, I might do that when we get another, when I get another higher tier thrall. Because I did notice looking through this um, admin... Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, it didn't have a name or anything. It was just a body laying there. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. Is I saw in the admin panel that there is chain bindings. Which sound really cool. Alright, so in the meantime, what I need to do is I need to get... We have Rhino Hide for Aquilonian Armor. I need to go get Steel. And I'm going... Not Steel. I'm going to go get Chitin and Silk. And we'll kill anybody along the way who seems... Well, honestly, who seems like they're going to get in our way. <laughs> our shrines need their guards. Oh, and we're going to venture to the Volcano. That is definitely something I want to do this episode, uh, the stream episode, whatever. Nope, couldn't put anybody on the Wheel of Pain. I will. I have the black ice to do it. So I will make that shack up on the volcano, Stahor. Be nice to have a place to stop off along the way.
But yeah, Wasteland, I couldn't put them on the Wheel of Pain, so I just uh, murdered them. <laughs> I'm not positive about the thatch roof stahor, but I'll think about it. Alright, there are a bunch of those creatures over here that I can kill for chitin. Should probably switch out my dagger, though, to the actual skinning knife. So I can get the chitin. I do like the weather effects. This is not our normal path. <laughs> I took a detour. The hell did I end up? Yeah, no, I gotta go that way. <laughs> so, through here. Also, on a side note, you guys let me know if you hear any good or bad differences in the sound quality since the last stream or some of my videos I've been tweaking my audio settings and my audio equipment quite a bit today trying to experiment to improve sound quality so let me know what you guys think also welcome back Michael Okay. Uh, see if it'll... I can send you another invite. I'm in a situation where I can, so give me a moment. to do that. Also, thanks for the feedback, Stahor. Oh, it's not a problem. It's not like it takes much effort for me to send an invite. Where the hell are you going, dude? Yeah, I'm starting to get that I'm starting to get that impression. Come on. More bugs, please. I have not wasteland. I want to. But I haven't really had time to make it to the movies in a while now, unfortunately. <laughs> so... It's not a well, it's kind of a cave. The hell? It is really weird. Huh. Let me see if I send an invite through Conan directly. Nothing in here. I think I probably have enough chitin to make the uh, Stygian gear for two of my underlings. I see. I mean, I'm not really surprised, but, yeah. <laughs> ow, 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 mother. All right, dude. 
Well, just in case I needed more rhino hide. I think the rhinos are bugged. <laughs> no, no. Rhino hide. Not thick hide. Rhino hide. I see. I wouldn't have any idea what the scene you're talking about is, but seems like every movie has a scene that people get irritated about these days, so I don't know. I'm gonna murder another... Oh. That is not a sound I believe a rhino makes, but... Okay. Yeah, the rhinos are bumped. <laughs> Holy shit. It's like I can't even skin them without them basically flying like that. kinds of amusement about watching him go airborne like that. Hmm. Now where should we go to find some spiders? Also, I am full up on resources. I'm gonna leave the honey here. I don't need the honey. Is that really kind of what it comes down to? I mean, if you look at it that way, isn't that the, um... If you're gonna get mad at the newest movie for something like that, isn't that the problem with all the movies? This shit wouldn't have happened if we weren't stupid. Just saying. I mean, to be fair, that's a good thing to be, that is a good thing to be irritated by. It's like, why? Like, again, if you guys weren't stupid, this wouldn't have happened. Let's see if some of the things down here that I can collect chitin from are back. And I need to find a good source of silk. To be fair, I should probably have those efficiency gathering tools we mentioned before, so...
those guys over here? Nope, they're gone. Okay. Ah. Okay, so no more insects over here to get the chitin, but I think we have enough chitin and enough rhino hide to make the uh, Aquilonian and the Stygian. We already have the armor for the, uh, what's it called? The Emirian Shrine. So I think all that's left would be getting silk from Lemurian and making the Darfari set to guard the Yogg Shrine. So we're doing pretty well. I do need to go and capture some damn melee fighters, though, because I've been ignoring them for archers. That is true. Where is that? I marked it, too. Oh, it's over here. Scuttler Shortcut. So yeah, if we came down here and dropped through here, we could get a lot of silk. Okay. Thanks for the reminder. I will go drop off all the crap I'm carrying, and we'll go get that. Shouldn't take long to even reach it. That does seem like a bit of a dumb reason to get upset, but ah well. <laughs> uh, do you get one, Michael, if you try to start a game on your own? Also, on a side note, Stavor, I completely agree with you about the writing in movies. I It does drive me nuts when that same scenario happens. It's like, yeah, all this bad shit happened because people are stupid. <laughs> huh. That is odd, Michael. There should be no difference between... There should be no reason that should be triggering. The hell? Yeah, I should make some more tools before we head that way. Okay. Well, it's kind of funny, <laughs> um... Michael, I think you are actually half spawning into my game. Because I just saw all my melee bodyguards that murdered you rushing to where you spawned earlier. I don't even know where half of them are now. They're just all over the damn place. Oh, here they come. <laughs> the hell? So what I think I might do as well is instead of doing my own <laughs> they seem to and these weren't my normal ones coming after you these were like the hero thralls I might actually convert a couple of these thralls over here my bot my chief bodyguards here into the guards of my various shrines. 
Yeah, let's see about making some of these tools. Let's see, hardened steel tools. Or was it the blacksmith? I don't actually remember. Yep, there they are. Uh, pick. So we just need the hardened steel and a bunch of shaped wood. That'll be easy. So we'll make all four of these, and I'll also make a pickaxe. And I'll put some efficiency up. Well, I might as well do it with the ones I have. So leather and branches. Okay. Yeah, well, might as well give it a try. I mean, I didn't expect it to work the first time I tried the... You know, I'm just going to get rid of this hardened steel pick here that does absolutely nothing. I think that's almost about to break. But yeah, I didn't expect the pickaxe to work like it did on the glowing goop, but it did. So I might give it another try. Uh, let's see, you have shaped wood. I'll take that. Drop both over here. Grabbed something else, didn't I? Yeah, the leather. Oh, god damn it, branches. <laughs> I have them somewhere. I know I do. Okay, I'm gonna take the thick hide and I'm gonna put the chitin in here. And I think I already put the other shit away, so. That's not where they actually get crafted. Here we go. Okay. I don't need the horns. Don't need that. Just organizing my inventory, and we'll go get some sticks. I think you should have some, because I was using you to get arrows. You don't. You don't. Ah, uh, well, off to collect some sticks. Usually find some around here. There they are. I don't know how that counts as a branch, but hey. Not gonna argue, it makes it easy to spot. That's a branch, but that uh, but these things, no. Okay, let's open this up. Let's go get my pickaxe, a decent pickaxe. One that isn't falling apart. Now I need to figure out, I don't remember who made the, well, I think these guys make the tool efficiency kits. Let's take a look. Ooh. Let's make two, three, yeah, let's make four of those. What's up? So let's see. Yeah, the advanced tool upgrade kit. I kind of want to throw in all my tools right now. Any particular reason, Michael? Hmm. 
durability, you say. Uh, let's see if I can even find it. Weapons and armor more durable. Shit, I know how to make a Lemurian sword? I mean, I don't want one, but apparently I know how to make one. I thought I just learned how to make Lemurian armor. Hmm, that's weird. I'm not seeing the durability upgrades, but either way, let's go get our... Let's go get our silk. It's not a huge issue right now. Uh, let's get, grab one more batch of food. Ah, so it still does go bad in here, even with the black ice. Okay. It's good to know. I'll take the black ice out of there. Grab this. Let's go throw this in the black ice box. I have not, actually. I've not been able to get to decorations, period, with all the other stuff I've been trying to pull off Wasteland. Let's see, how much actual hardened steel do I have? I have a lot of hardened steel. Oh yeah, I have a shit ton of hardened steel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've mostly been making the base, the shrines, and our troops to protect the place. Haven't really had a chance for the decorations yet, but I definitely want to get to it. Anyway, let's go to Weaver's Hollow and get us some spider stuff. I think we're going in the right way. Eh, basically. You know, if I don't get stuck just staring at a tree. drop off. Oh, I don't have a one-handed weapon on me. <laughs> huh? Feel free to share, Wasteland. I don't want to cross through right here because I don't want to deal with the uh, the den. I want to come across to Chaos Mouth, it looks like. Eh, sorry about that. What would it I would what would I need to do on my part? Like to see if we could get it working, so maybe I can do it after the stream or something. Yeah. 
That could work. Definitely sounds like it would be effective. I don't know that we have a lot of open land around our main, you know, fortress to do that, but we can try. I'm going to try upgrading the main castle to some black ice first, though. Well, maybe at the same time. I actually don't know. Ah, I see. Chaos mouth around here somewhere. Ah, is it up there? I did not bring my climbing gear. Well, I can give it a try after the stream, and we can figure it out then. Give it a shot, real quick. Yeah, but they really did make it kind of a bitch to actually get co-op working, didn't they? Gotcha. Eh, who knows? That might be the way to go, then. Is just do the... Uh, well, eventually. I don't want to give up what I've got now. But eventually give a shot with, a, with my own server rather than just co-op. Might do that after I have the DLC. Because then I can try to build my base from the ground up with the Catan and the... I think they said August was the Aquilonian uh, DLC, so... Yeah. be an interesting way to mess with it. Alright, let's take a look now. We are almost at the Scuddler's shortcut. Is it hot? It's right there. Or it's not. Let's get the sickle and the pickaxe out. I 
should probably also keep out the skinning knife, frankly. I can use more chitin. I mean, that could be true about the connection. Hey, Crystal. And yeah, that is a very good idea, Wasteland. Spiders. Man, we one-shot the bastards. I don't want no damn feral flesh. That does me no good. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. It does, actually. The pickaxe works very well on crystal. If I hadn't already collected those ones, I think it would have worked there as well. This is what I'm looking for. Doesn't affect it at all. Doesn't affect it at all. Okay, so the pickaxe does not work on Gossamer. It's worth a shot. Oh, okay. So we just pick it up manually. If I want to leave here with a lot of crystal, though. Get off the gossamer. Apparently the skinning knife, though, should be used on the spider, so... Ooh, and I missed a few. <clears throat> really? I just want enough of this stuff to make a um, to make my Lemurian armor. Not what I wanted to do. Yep. Oh, Kind of frustrating trying to hit the actual crystal deposits, but when you do... <laughs> that is a nice amount of... Holy shit. Good thing it doesn't weigh a lot, right? crystal. Alright. Let's get on that. Thanks for the tip, Stahor. I had no idea. Really? Oh, I harvested from... That's kind of fucked up. I harvested from that spider while it was still alive. Get the feeling I'm about to drop some chitin. I think a thousand crystals good. And 
I'll drop the chitin because I know it's fairly heavy. It's actually really heavy. Holy shit. So yeah, thanks to all the advice, crafting silk by hand and, you know, Michael and yeah, the reminding me that I need crystal for the radium because I completely forgot about that shit. I forgot that that was a requirement for it. Yeah, I remember reading about that. I heard it was pretty buggy though. But I've never tried it myself, so I don't know how if it I don't know if it really is that buggy or if they fixed it. Yeah, I have no idea. Red light district for district fortress, huh? <laughs> I see. I think he might very well be doing that. And frankly, that's how I'm gonna picture it from here on out. Howard's knitting while he's going through the dungeon. Pretty sure this spider can whoop my ass, so. Oh, have you now? <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna give it a shot, Wasteland, but I'm pretty sure it can kill me. But yes, that's how I'm picturing this in my head now, is Howard the Knitting Barbarian. All right, dude, bring it down. Now let's see how much damage I actually did to it. Almost none. However, considering how slow he is, if I had brought my poison arrows and my bow, I probably could have dropped him eventually. Especially if I bring my antidotes. Uh, the antidotes of set that I've been making. I have a thousand crystal. I think we're good for now. <laughs> I was tempted to bust out the um, pickaxe and get a few more, but I think we have enough. This is the way we entered in the first place. Oh yeah, pincushion that thing with the snake arrows of Set. Let him feel the burn of poison. Hmm? 
All right, so we have a fair amount of silk. I don't know if it's enough. Uh, for the Lemurian armor, for two Lemurian armored bodyguards. There's only one way to find out. <laughs> On a side note, do you guys know if they've fixed the um, absolutely creepy bug? for named thralls that look like they have these weird-ass alien bug eyes. Because that shit's disturbing. I was only planning on making the normal version. I haven't been making epic version of anything for my thralls. I mean, I suppose I could. My thralls have just been making do with whatever the hell I give them. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, I remember you. Yeah, I heard it was a pretty widespread issue, but yeah, maybe they did fix it. Because I haven't looked at my hero thralls in a very long time, my named thralls, because of that issue. It's like, yeah, nope, I'm just going to ignore them. Mm, I don't know if my dude can climb that right now without the climbing gear. Ah, he should be able to once he strips down. Hmm? <laughs> I do an admin panel. It's not what I want to do. I want to take this off and climb manually. Come on. <laughs> I don't remember what bows my archers have. I think they have hardened steel, actually. I have to double check. But I do think it's hardened steel. This is going to be close. No, it's not. Yeah, I haven't made. I Like I said, I haven't bothered making exquisite anything for my dudes. I don't have that many resources, <laughs> considering how many archers I have. Yep, fuck this. Real quick, I'm just gonna... Let's get back to where we need to be. Oh, same here. I've got, I don't know how many archers at this point. Let's see. 5, 10, 15, 20. I probably have about 80. I have like 80 to 90 teeth, uh, tier 3 slash named archer thralls in my base. And I think a grand total of eight melee thralls. So yeah, I have way, way too many thralls. Well, I guess it doesn't matter if I have a lot of thralls or not. <laughs> Shit, I needed to collect ivory while we were down there for, uh, you know. Would the mammoths give me ivory? They should, right?
Yeah, let's see. We'll do a bit of an airborne view of my place when we get there, because at this point I actually don't remember how many thralls I have. <laughs> You're right, there is no need to be worried about how many thralls I have. They should help if I ever do get hit by the purge. Alright, we're gonna go kill a, ma a mammoth on the way. Because I do need that for some of my gear. I have a named taskmaster. I have named carpenters. And I have... Let's see, what else do I have named? I have three named armorers and one named blacksmith. And two named smelters. And then, yeah, I have the six named fighters that I keep in the Grand Hall. It's kind of like my bodyguards. Two of them I kept finding down in the... Where are they? Yeah, in the Pagoda of Boundless Lusts. Waros the ba uh, Breaker and I think May the Blade. So... It's also where I got my first named armorer. In case you're curious about getting a named armorer, Michael. Uh, Pagoda of Boundless Lusts. You can find the Lemurian one there from time to time. Let's see if I can go find her and get her name, because I don't remember what she was called. Or was she the blacksmith? No, it was the... Yeah. If you want a named blacksmith, Michael, the easiest place, I found it there every single time, has been up here. Not Leon's Watch, sorry. Freya's Hovel. Okay, well, just saying, if you're looking for a named blacksmith, that is the one spot I've found a named crafting thrall. 100% of the time. Because I know they can have ridiculous spawn rates, and yeah, I find it there every single time. I know, right? The experience you get from crafting that shit is crazy. Okay, now that we're here, let's go ahead and fly and I can see how many archer thralls I have. Let's see, we have four per tower. Five, six, seven. So we have four towers, so that's 16. We're at 40 so far. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just going to extrapolate. We probably have about 80 archer thralls down here alone, and probably another 20 up here. I really like these guys' armor, though. Zamorian thief armor. So... Anyway, we're going to go back down here. <laughs> so 
let's see. I believe Fia. Yeah, she can make the flawless Lemurian stuff. Yeah, so it's Fia. Who, um... I got at the Pagoda of Boundless Lust. It was an armor. Okay, so I need perfected medium chest padding. If I want Lemurian Warrior and Lemurian Royal Gown. Ooh, I need silk for that. Ooh, Jesus, a lot of silk for that. Let's look at their perfected stuff. Oh, that's right. I need... Yeesh. To make all this stuff layered silk and hardened leather, I need a lot, and I do mean a lot, of, um, well, frankly, a lot of everything, but I need a lot of, specifically, a lot of alchemical powder. Or alchemical whatever that thing was called. Alright, so I'm gonna drop all this stuff here. Get out of my inventory for now. Don't need this, don't need this. Honestly, don't need the fur, but I'll keep it. Yeah, I'll take a look at the base Lemurian. Because frankly, the base armor is good enough for your thralls for the most part. Oh, and shit, I already made the perfected light stuff. An entire set. So I just need to give her regular silk and she can make the flawless... Oh shit, let's go get that. I don't know where the hell I got it, or and I don't even remember getting that, but sure. Let's make the flawless um, Lemurian gown. Give that to one of our thralls. Perfected medium, what do you need for that? Hardened leather. Hmm. 35 hardened leather, which is going to require... Oh, I know that. I was just talking about... Um, I didn't realize I'd already made all the light equipment. Like, the perfected, the flawless wraps, it, like, the flawless framework. So I didn't think I had enough silk. So hardened leather. Yep, I need 35 alchemical base. And thick leather and light leather. Let's see how much we actually have. But yeah, that was the first named armorer I got was the Lemurian one. And then I got really excited going, hey, I can get flawless Lemurian. And then it's like, oh shit, I don't know the Lemurian recipes. Do I have any alchemical powder? I have 12 alchemical base. Yeah, we need gold, and we need gold badly. Hey, we have the corrupted stone. Take this off of here. I'm gonna grab the aloe extract. And I think we're gonna make our way to the volcano, because I fucking need gold. And where's my torch so I can turn it back on? Not what I want to do. Black ice. Foundations, please. So I need steel reinforcements and insulated wood for everything black ice related. Steel reinforcements, I think we're good on those as well. Wrong cupboard, I think. There we go. Grab a couple.
couple of these. And we're going to go. Let's see. Let's make a black ice reinforced wooden door. A door frame. Nine foundations. Four of the. Well, let's see. So let's go with four of these. And where's the actual wall? I'm like 20 of these. <laughs> you really want that thatched roof, don't you? <laughs> Fine. We'll do a thatch roof. <laughs> <laughs> hey organic how's it going oh I am gonna upgrade the base with black ice materials wasteland for now this these materials are for use in the at the volcano because I need a base up in the volcano to get um, yeah, I need a uh, base up there where I can collect gold and where I don't have to run all the way back down here for like I don't have to run all the way from here to get my shit if I happen to die alright I think that's enough thatch oh yeah I'm gonna do that definitely okay Oh, I need sticks, too, while I'm down here, so... Good thing I saw that before we got to the damn volcano. Oh, there are my branches. What game, Organic? Ah. Haven't played that one. Is that what we're calling the fertilizer shack style or the shit shack? Okay, we need four corner pieces and Ah. Yeah, I've been getting my fix for that. Organic in um with the Forza Horizon games. I'm in the same boat. It's too damn hot here, too. Right, let's get rid of all this wood. And the seeds, and the resin, and the highland berries. Now I am legitimately jealous, Organic. <laughs> uh, 
over this way? Yes, yeah, over this way. Drop this, drop this. And we're gonna make a chest for the base. Okay, let's leave this black ice behind. Yeah, see, we didn't use much black ice at all to make this material. Beautiful. Okay. I'm gonna leave the lash over here because don't need it. Let's see what we need to make a chest. Shaped wood and iron. Ah, he's got both for me. Iron reinforcements is the mistake. I'll make two of them. Hmm. Drop this off. And drop off the shape of wood. Alright, let's go. I think that's all we need. Uh, I should probably make a bed roll or something. Maybe just a normal... Just make a cheap bed to leave up there. Okay, we need twine, hide, and leather. Well, hide, twine, and, sorry, wood. All right, so let's go get some wood. That's enough. I know we have twine. Ah, I'm gonna need hide. I know for a fact I don't have any untreated hide at this point. So we're gonna go play with the wolves for a minute. Just wanted to make sure we had plenty of water for our trip into the volcano. Oh, I have. He's not a boss. <laughs> I wish he was. He was, but unfortunately he's not, so I've killed him a couple times. Let's go ahead and jump around up here and get some normal hide so we can craft a bed that we can keep in the shack in the mountains. Mountains. Volcano. And I don't think I'm going to take a spare suit of armor. I'm pretty sure with my passive health regeneration, frostbite isn't a risk for our character, really. 
Besides, we only have to put up with Frostbite for a very short amount of time. <laughs> I see. Let's see here. So we have plenty of plant fiber. I know we have twine sitting around here. <laughs> I mean, they are tasty. <laughs> Let's see. We have the twine. I'm going to leave the fur out here. Don't need the fur. Ah, I need the wolf pelts. Make a pool at the volcano cabin. <laughs> I mean, I don't have another use for it, so I could. Okay, you're the one who can break it down. Oh, nope, not you. You. I believe these are the ones that can break the pelts down, aren't they? Hope so. Been so long since I've had to do it, I don't remember. There it is. Sure. Craft 200 of the damn things. I only need 40. <laughs> Sauna demanded. Man, that you're going to try to make me make that mountain cabin near the volcano nicer than my main one. Let's see. I think we have everything we need to make one of the beds. I like the Stygian style bed. We're going to craft one of those. Hmm. Just realized I need to give him a bit more pelts. There. Come on, all the way down here. We know where it is. Craft another 40. Did I already finish the damn bed? Ah, I did. Okay, cool. Okay, have your twine back. And let's see. I need I need armor repair kits is actually what I need before we head back down. <laughs> oh shit. Real quick, I didn't know I had that. <laughs> now, need to find my armor repair kits. I used to keep them in here, but I don't think I have any spares. I don't. What are my attributes at? Let's see. Yeah, right there. <laughs> I need a cape. Oh shit, I already have hardened leather. How do I keep forgetting I have these resources just laying around? can't make my armor repair kit, can you? Can you? Makes the armor repair kit. 
Ah, it's the patch kit. You know what? Make me five of these. Actually, you know what? Take. Oh, yeah. Make me five. You guys can cancel this job. I need the armor repair kits more right now. <laughs> Trying to make Howard into a villain, it sounds like. All right. And as... We, can I repair it while I'm wearing it? Please? <sighs> no. Repair kit level is too low. Uh-oh. Oh, that's right. I haven't found the dude who... Damn it. <laughs> yeah, I haven't found the particular... I haven't found the particular uh, master armorer who can make master repair kits. I need to find him. Here, you keep this. Keep the fangs. Let's go put the silk and the heavy leather over here. The hardened leather. Now, Lemurian warrior shit. Twat. God damn it. <laughs> huh, yeah, I haven't been able to find the master repair kit of either of my options. My named guys can't make it. Nobody seems to be able to make it for me. Let's put the medium. I'm gonna craft all this shit. <laughs> Once again, though, Michael, the bed and breakfast thing was not Howard's fault. When there's a chaos invasion, shit happens. I will say it is kind of disappointing that there isn't a heavy Lemurian armor. Or if there is, I completely missed it. Okay, I'm going to take all this armor. And because I'm encumbered, I'm going to do a quick little flight. No. May. You come with me. You are a shrine bodyguard now. Now, where is Waros the Breaker? Because he's Lemurian as well. There he is. Much easier to do it this way. I mean, I don't even have a shrine priest at the moment, but hey. Alright, 
Give me your Sumerian shit, dude. And have Lemurian shit. Okay, you look weird as hell, dude. Anybody else see this weird shit with his legs? Oh, they did fix it. Her eyes are not... Well, maybe they still are. I don't know. Yep, no, her eyes are still all fucked up. Alright, then. Take the slippers. Torso. Sarong, which we can't even see. There, crown piece. There it is. Can't even see that either. Well, these are the bodyguards for this place. Not gonna lie, I kind of want to use the admin panel to get myself a Durketto priest because it's driving me nuts that I can't actually get one otherwise because I haven't bothered to put one in the game yet, aside from the admin panel. Well, here you go. If you're interested when you come north, Michael, if we ever manage to get you back into the game, there are a couple pairs of exceptional Sumerian armor in the basement. <laughs> I think I'm gonna, because I am not pleased with the way the game is making it, so I have to... Yeah, the Durketto thing is driving me nuts. Oh shit, I got a box full of weapons in the kitchen. Help yourself. Alright, spawn humanoids. Nothing under Diketto. I imagine it would be a Lemurian priest though, right? Huh. Interesting. I was kind of hoping I'd see one just listed there, but nope. Not Durketto. I wonder if it's one of those ones like you have to know their actual name. I will. really played with this much, so I don't really know what these different settings do. Ah, it is a particular name. Okay. Hmm. Okay, then. Starts with a D. Huh. Okay, thank you. While you're at it, if you can find the Emir one too, that'd be nice. <laughs> okay, never mind. Okay, so we're going that away next. I don't know if we have the weight to carry the, um, the giant well. Like, I think that thing's heavy as hell. We can. Holy shit, Howard's a strong bastard. Let's 
see how things are going over here at our shrine to Emir. Yeah, I think I'm going to put two of my heroes over here and just take this Nordheimer armor from them and give it to the heroes. Although I guess Sumerian would work too. Excellent! 120 manifestations of zeal. We could actually upgrade to an exalted altar of Emir with just 400 hardened bricks. Let's do that. Erot the Clairvoyant. Okay. 400 hardened bricks. Since we are over encumbered, let's just... Obama the Frostbitten. <laughs> That's... Okay. I don't know how you're Frostbitten, but, oh, you know, I'm not gonna ask. <laughs> Take these bricks. Upgrade to the Exalted Altar of Amir. Let's see about these priests. And there is a female Obama the Frostbitten. Hmm. Ah, oh, well. I'm gonna go with Obama the Frostbitten. And... Erot the Clairvoyant. Ah, okay. So you. Yep. Ah, her eyes are normal. Go drop off the priest to Deketo. And then we finally have priests at all of our shrines. Like the appropriate priests for all of our shrines. Alright, there we go. Alright, now that's done, let's just go ahead and hit, go back to this, and let's head to the north. Believe there's only three levels of shrine, but I could be wrong. I don't remember if there's another one after Exalted Altar, but we got shit to do in the volcano, so let's go do it. gonna get cold as hell along the way. Holy shit, really? <laughs> like, all of them priests, or some of them, like, fighters and shit? That just seems crazy. <laughs> wow, alright. Well, thanks for looking those up. Piss off, wolf. Just get to the bridge, sweep across, and then head on up to the volcano. I 
I see. You know what? You were chasing me way too fucking far, wolf. Enough. Now, let's see. The path to the volcano we took before was through Ice Spire Chasm, but it looks like I can probably just go straight through here and across here. Oh, fuck off with you. Get him off my ass while I look at my map. That would be one of my favorite game mechanics ever, Organic Zero. You kill enough of a certain type of enemy, or if you're so far above them in level, they're just like, you know what? Fuck that dude, I ain't messing with him. I think it should start to warm up very quickly. I like how I'm still frostbitten on the edges of a volcano. I mean, I can see lava right there, man. <laughs> Pickaxe. <laughs> Shit. Well, let's drop off the obsidian and the raw ash. Because I need to build my house before I go about all this other shit. It's not warming up. <laughs> and I think up here it's not going to let me build, so I need to build farther down here. See if we can build the shack right here. I know once we get up to the top part, they're not going to let us. So it's probably best just to build it down here. Well, that may be true, but once we get up here where the, like, columns and shit show up, they're not going to let me. Yeah, 
Let's see, once we get up here, this... Yeah, see, building's not allowed. Not allowed. Yep. Right here is the closest we can build to the volcano. <laughs> well, after we get past here, everything is pretty much... Um... <laughs> the fuck was that? Yeah, once we go past here, it is pretty much all this material, so I don't think they'll let me build over there. They might let me build up here. Ah, uh, yes, right here. Don't want to build right here, though. That would interfere with the obsidian deposits. A little higher up? Yes, but not right there. <laughs> I mean, I guess we could try this. I don't think this is going to work. Or I could be 100% wrong. Yeah, it's a good spot. Good call on going farther in. I mean, farther up the road. Man, I really like the look of black ice on this side. Oh, we have one extra. Go ahead and put the bed down. Put the chests down. Now twine, not twine, a uh, thatch. Can't believe we're gonna make this out of thatch. Corners. Two, three, four. Then two, three, four of those. Now, since I am not going to die by falling into lava right here, I'm not going to try to climb on the outside here. Oh, don't be doing this now. that way? Huh. Guess I do. Seems a little odd. But it works. Only problem is now is wondering if I brought enough thatch or enough uh, plant fiber. All right, let's build, you know, 10 of those and probably another three or four of these. Let's see what happens. You 
know, the cult that's up here living on the other side of the volcano is probably wondering what the fuck they're watching. We had plenty of materials. Alright, there we go. I don't have the materials to make any stairs, do I? I should be able to make stone stairs pretty quickly just by mining in this area. Ah. Stone brick, stone brick. Yep, the sandstone stairs don't ever have a... But that's fine. Give me a second for a little bit more stone. And there we go. <laughs> Interesting place. in here. Don't need plant fiber. Don't need this. Give me my water skin and my food back. And now the well. This is going to be interesting. Yeah, this giant thing, I don't... Okay, I'm gonna need to fly if I want to be able to even see what the hell I'm doing with that. Yep, see you, Wasteland. Have a good night. Well, I am going to leave this in the hut for now. Because I do not have the materials to make, um, to make the foundations for that thing. So, I'm going to leave the pool in the chest. Alright, now that we have a lot of space left, let's go see about getting ourselves some gold dust.
Jesus. I wonder if they made it so this doesn't give gold anymore. Would have gotten some by now, normally. Goldstone. That is a ridiculously low drop rate. Holy shit. Yeah, that's definitely true. See you over here. Where were all these bastards on the way up? Cumbered. Good God. Honestly, I'm carrying a lot of shit right now. I don't need to anyway. Yep. I don't think I'll be coming up here for this stuff anymore <laughs> for the gold. I think this area is pretty much only good for the obsidian. Good god, I don't remember the drop rate being quite that abysmal. I think they must have tweaked it a bit more. Which is frustrating. There should be... I really wish there were goldstone nodes then if they're going to make the drop rate this low. At least now we don't have to worry about dying up here because of the heat. Like, this armor's not gonna let us get hot. used to it, people walking by me like that and not trying to kill me, so that was a bit off-putting. They have all that Serpent Man gear. I mean, I guess, yeah, that really does make sense, Michael. It's just still, it's like... I think it'd be better to just put the gold nodes in really high level places. You seem important, are you? No. Oh 
Fuck off, snake. Oh, my dude's actually getting hot now. Where do I go from here? Oh, up this way. Don't mind the sword. I'm just prepared for your snakes and you people. get back to the weird yes I did it updated as I manually did it and it updated as soon as I came into this place like when I built that castle ah sorry placed the bed Goldstone. We, at least we got four out of that batch. Also, 70 stone. Don't need it. Thralls. Cigar and fighter. Sekus the Smith. I remember trying to capture you and dying in the process to lava. I ain't gonna be trying to take you now. I don't need you. Goldstone will do. Yeah, apparently the nice thing about getting, if I end up getting, um, obsidian shit is that that stuff over there. Uh, is that while it does suck that you have to come up here to craft it, once you have it crafted, it's easy to repair. So, if I can make obsidian tools, I will. Okay, we got a good run of goldstone there. Cool, cool. This, this, this. I feel like our pick's gonna run out before we do, but hey. Have some water. Goldstone! <laughs> Creepy cult! Okay, now the gold stone's starting to kick in. Thirty-eight, hell yeah. Yep, nope, don't really need to talk to this psychopath. He's just weird as hell. Devotee. Think they get mad if I killed them all? <laughs> now we're starting to get to areas we couldn't really explore because we were out of... We were out of water and we were dying from the heat.
Thing is, I very well might miss the... the obsidian recipe. I'm pretty sure we activated this, but I'm going to double check. Because I have no bloody clue where the obsidian recipe is. I just know it's up here on the, in the volcano area. Already attuned. Any walls lighting up? Nope. That seems like a way we should go, but so does that. Actually, that's where we came from, essentially, so. This looks interesting over here. What the fuck? Yeah, no, how about you don't put me that close to the boundary wall? I'd be okay not going to the boundary wall. Alright, so when I came back from that... Bitches. Okay, so I guess we're going this way. Well, I did want to see what this was. Nah, it's something I want to get any closer to. Thank you. This path seems important. Yeah, so what I was going to go look at was a was the lava mouth essentially. Can I see my hut from here? Ew. I see that creepy ass thing. I do not like the staircases these people use. scared the shit out of me. So we just done with staircases? Here's another narrow, steep-ass staircase. Oh yeah, no, this is amazing.
Kind of wish the sun were out so I could see where I was going. see if it brightens up in here because I can't see the path even with my damn torch because obviously they want us to go over there and yeah it looks like if we look from here, I need to go down here, through here, and up through there. Gotta say, I like the look of the place in general. doesn't go that way. Yeah, I can't tell where it connects and where it doesn't. Jesus. Across lava. Yeah, I can see better now, so let's take a look. Oh, there is no way in hell that this is the right path. <laughs> Survive the heat of the volcano. I think if we're going to get across, we have to get across on the other side. And I don't have the stamina to climb that. Do now. That's new. I slid up. Hmm. 
Pretty sure I can't make that jump in any way, shape, or form. But I'd have to jump from there to there to there. What the fuck? You know what would have been nice to bring? Climbing gloves. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Ah, <laughs> uh, I think that's an entrance to something. Swear to God, if they expect me to jump on one of those blocks right there, they can kiss my ass on that one. Well, I need to burn for a minute. That's right, I can't. Fuck. I'll start taking damage and drop. Ah, shit, that's right. There is a double jump mechanic, isn't there? That's right. I forgot all about that. I mean, this seems like it'd be the shortest spot to jump across, but there is no way. Nope, I did not come prepared for a jumping puzzle. Well, this sucks. <laughs> I should have brought climbing gloves, which I don't think I could have used for very long just because of the heat. I do, but contrary to what that would lead you to believe, it does not help me at all. <laughs> the high ground's kind of useless. Okay, so we're back up here. Jump in there. <laughs> I don't even remember how the hell to get up out of here. <laughs> I don't like this place. I feel like that might be the best way to get there.
It seems like it might be easier to get down on it from get down to it from that side. Ooh, that scared the shit out of me. Ah, uh, in this bag, I got a second one. Get to that center area. Like if I can get there and come down, I might be able to do something with that. Climbing gear is way the hell back, but yeah, that's probably the best bet. Yeah, it's probably the best idea. Yeah, I'll take a look at it real quick. Let's see what this shows us. The top, really, there's no reason to fight. I see. It's an interesting option. Where the hell am I? But I think we should exit this area for now. <laughs> we don't have we're running out of supplies and shit. I know this isn't the way home though. Just wanted to check this area out. Terrace of the Tenders. So I was trying to get a close look at this one last time. And then we decided to try to capture somebody. I certainly haven't been up here. Bridge of Vormithadreth. Okay. Sure. Doesn't sound like nonsense at all. That feels like it might be a good path to take, but we're not prepared right now. Noxious gases, really. Noxious gases, I see. <laughs> oh. Oh, there go my legs. Hey, I know where we're at now. Cool, I have all of those ingredients. Actually, I have no fucking clue where I'm at. <laughs> Apparently, I found a road, though.
feel like I don't like this area. Fuck it. Oh. Thought this was the way out. It is clearly not. The what now? I swear to God if we just found the route down there when I was trying to leave. Oh yeah, I'm really not comfortable now. chest. Absinthe. Okay. <gasps> Please don't dive off. There's the fucking path. It's on that side of the lava. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> oh yeah, we wouldn't make that jump at all. Question is, can we get over there? Only one way to find out. A couple broken legs. Heat stroke. <laughs> Almost falling into lava. Why the hell don't you fuckers have like a road leading here? The Well of Skellis. A named Tanner. Really, Ferris Flickertum. I don't know how the hell I would drag your ass out of here, but. Explore a bit. Do you? Archer. I'm just seeing if there's something out here before I do. Like a lore stone or something. Nothing that even remotely glows. Ooh, but there's stairs right here.
Yeah, no, this looks like a great idea. If you didn't look at me wrong, I'm going to murder you all. to find the obsidian shit. I have no clue where it is. But apparently there's a dude calling to me to murder him. So, away we go. <laughs> it's gonna be a giant snake, isn't it? get into a combo because I don't want to fall off the edge here. Yeah, see? <laughs> Screw that shit. Oh, well. Narrow-ass stairs right there. Listen here, you snake or you snake worshiping fox. Leave me be. I kinda did. Come to me. See, a snake dude in and of himself is not strong. It's everybody else that's with him. Corpses go. They all just slide into the lava. <laughs> I'll take some water. All right. Let's heal up. <laughs> and murder the guards one at a time. Oh, fuck it. I don't know if you're going to come after me later. Hey, look at that. That alone made it worthwhile. I don't have... 
have the recipes. Dude, I get it. You've already told me. has had enough of your nonsense. Ah, gotcha. You know, just like when we ran into the boss of the Silent Legion, I feel like we weren't prepared for this. Sure. There we go. I'm now over encumbered though, so. You want me to kill your own people? There's a lot of motherfuckers over there. That's apparently not the way to go. Well, I think they saw me. Oh, wait, what? armor, right? Nothing over here. Alright, that away. I know! Essentially supposed to be the end game dungeon, just out of curiosity. I'm not gonna lie, it would be really cool to build a base down here. <laughs> the fuck are you guys? Oh, 
I get the feeling this is where we would learn to make the snake man armor. What are you? Imagine we are expected to just jump over this. Not gonna lie, it makes me nervous. I hear you. supposed to go. Unless there's this little bridge here. Ah. Jump in lava. Hi. Well, shit. Yeah, I really don't like the looks of this. I'm gonna take a look down there, though, yeah. <clears throat> don't like the looks of this either. I'm assuming we're going that way. Expected to murder everything? I mean, I will. To Zoe Azurana Zoo, Zoo Zulu Zoo, Uzura Zoo, Nana Zoe Anar, Azun Zura Zosai. No more humans for them to devour? Can I just walk right through them? That'd be hilarious. Oh. Nope. I cannot.
Nope, that didn't do shit. Hmm. Yeah, everything's dead. either. What the fuck? I see no switches, and everything's been murdered. Hmm. Ah, it won't let me. It says I can't climb these. Let's find out. Don't think I'll be doing that anytime soon. <laughs> Can I get up here? I can go up here. I am not going to make it to the top of this. Almost. Try that again. Nah, I'm not gonna make that. Aha! Cannot climb it, my ass. Heal up, we are dangerously low on water. That was not the right start for me. Let's heal up a little bit. Yeah, possibly. That was weird as hell. Climb. Ooh, don't jump down, you bastard. Okay. <laughs> ah, 
And I can't. Oh boy. Yeah, I think we hit a glitch. Yeah, I do not think we can go any further. Like, even if I backtrack out of the area and come back, I highly doubt the door is going to open. these guys. Pretty sure it was only this small group over here, but I'll check up the stairs in a second. Nope. Oh, uh, there isn't any. <laughs> I think that might be the best approach. Because that leads the exact opposite way we need to go. Alright. Easiest way to get through, then, since it seems we've run into a glitch. don't like stairs. Hey dudes. Let's play. curious where the hell we're supposed to go. Well, there's the path. Floating rocks. Oh, fuck <laughs> off.
trying to get over there, apparently. Ah! The path. Drink the alcohol. <laughs> You guys are assholes. Sure, why not? Absinthe. We are going to... We are going to fight the boss while extremely tipsy and on absinthe. I don't see anything wrong with this plan. Then you shouldn't put up a fight, dude. Can I just drink this? Just go stand in the middle of the water? Nope. Alright, well, we have just that much water. effect. I mean, I feel like we've seen it before. for someone who wants to go gratefully into the darkness. I'm just going to put that out there. Take it. Now, there's some shit in here I need. Gruel, maybe. I'll take that. We're not gonna make it out of here. We are so fucking far from the nearest source of water. 
So, behind him, where are my recipes? tablet so far. What the hell? Right of the chests? Oh, right there. Jesus. But we are gonna die on our way out, so... Shit. We came from that way. That is a broken path. There's a path that goes up on this side. Yeah, I feel like that's probably the right way to go. Holy shit. I feel like we need to go back to our castle. Especially since I have... gone well over how long I was supposed to stream. <laughs> ah, here we are. Fun thing is, we gotta go back there at some point <laughs> to get obsidian tool, to get obsidian, to craft obsidian. So that is not the end of the volcano for us. Ah, uh, you take damage very, very quickly. And that's the thing, is I can take more water skins. I don't know where I left them, but I have an entire supply of them. If I can find the damn things. Yeah. I have a whole supply of full water skins. Next time I'm taking all of them. And we will get the obsidian tools. But, holy shit, after that long-ass endeavor into the volcano, <laughs> I am actually out of time for tonight. So, thanks everybody for watching, and everybody have a good night. I will see you for the next stream. And yes, big sword, tools, and a lot of water skins. <laughs> I'm going to have to try to remake my current sword because I don't have the repair kits for it, but we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Thanks again for coming by, guys.